what's going on guys? Your boy X here. Today we're doing that Black Clover episode 169 live reaction. We got one more episode, folks. One more episode. Be on the lookout after the last episode of next week because I will be uh, definitely doing a... Um, what's the word I'm looking for? I will be doing a Black Clover video, you know. Uh, <laughs> Uh, I, I mentioned it in the comment section of the last video, so I won't say it now, but I will be doing another uh, another Black Clover video after the last episode, but uh, anyways, last we left off, uh, we got to meet the vice captain of the Black Bulls, Nick, Nitch, however you want to say his damn name, I keep saying Nick, y'all already know I'm bad with Nick, <laughs> uh, but he is pretty cool, you know, got shadow powers as well as he seems to have uh, uh, demons, or de devils that um, follow his commands like multiple so I don't know I guess we'll find out a later date with that maybe this episode um, and as well as Noel woke up to the, with the elves or whatever so I don't know what that's about but we're about to find out so let's go ahead and get started remember though guys for more Black Clover or even other animes because you have Black Clover rolling out to the end <laughs> live reaction slash reviews make sure I hit the subscribe button down below if you're new to the channel or you come here often and you ain't subscribed to check check <laughs> nah but uh yeah you know after black clover is over i will be doing other anime as well as the ones i'm probably already doing right now so just check the channel out if you're new here that's all i'm saying but uh let's go ahead and get started so it's gonna be sad man it's gonna be sad when black clover is over man I, i've been doing black clover for so long dog since like every tuesday i come home black clover you know but all right y'all about to begin this guys in five four three two one let's get it <coughs> Whoa, no, well, not. <laughs> so, have they just been living in peace right now, just chilling? Wow, everybody that got blown up. No, I was just looking amazed, like, oh my god. I mean, this beautiful place for Alicia. Huh. So, yeah, who are the children? What? I thought, uh, that her children are there? <laughs> One of the twins. I was so close. <laughs> I was so close to saying, "It's like, wait, who is taking care of the kids?" But okay, so she survived, huh? That's cool. So both, is it both the twins? Or because he kind of looks older than her. Maybe because he's taller. I don't know. That's. Mm, I guess that's. So. Dryad. Oh, 
I was about to say too, man. You know, it would have been really nice if they could have had helped out because you know they're all. Well, I don't know how they've been training since the Elf Arc, but eh, you know. Oh, they all use their own powers to survive the blow. Okay, well, shit. Oh, but I guess, you know, it, it exhausted their power. Charmy. <laughs> Charmy. Mimosa. Gojo was the only one that was standing up. Everybody else knocked the hell out. That's crazy. I guess that shows... I don't want to really say that because, I mean, I don't know how strong his opponent was. But I guess he didn't have to waste a lot of magic, what I'm trying to say. Damn, even my boy Luck on the ground. At least he moved a little bit. Everybody else looked like they knocked the hell out. Oh, she she twitched her <laughs> she twitched her fingers. Damn, well, mad as hell. Charmy looks adorable right now. I'm just, I'm sorry. Anywho. Man. Can I get a Charmy plushie? Is there a Charmy plushie out there, guys? Somebody let me know in the comment section. Is there a Charmy plushie? <laughs> this guy still. Whoa, when did she, wait, wait, wait a minute, when did Noelle just get a chest all of a sudden? <laughs> like, what just happened there? Ooh, okay, so the L's over here about the train now, that's interesting. I'm the only one left. Everyone else is dead. That shit. Damn, three days? I guess. I don't got no choice but to rush. Oh, that boy mad as hell. Must I'm gonna go get my princess back. Or queen, I guess it would be my bad. Get my queen back, you know. Oh, hey. Hey, I'm the only one for Charmy, real. Calm down. <laughs> mm mm mm. Vice Captain! <laughs> That boy pulled a Batman and dip. Oh shit. Oh, he came back. Oh. I wonder if any of do any of them know him? Guess we're about to find out. Get that nice little midway. <laughs> they all look confused as hell. <laughs> Cause I hate the black bull. Pass <laughs> 
<laughs> oh shit! Man, this guy here. Damn. Get this nigga out of my sight. Get this nigga out of my sight. Where is this nigga? Zora, I don't care, because Zora, he gonna come back. I know he gonna be good. But goddamn, Magma. Don't look like that. Oh shit, man. <laughs> Yo, he was actually kind of right about that. The greatest people in those are good from start. Got a point. Got a point. Well, he's spitting some hot shit in there. The worthless man's life. Calm down. I just can't believe they let him come up in the crib like that. Talk that hot shit to everybody. I just couldn't believe. I can't believe it. Uh <laughs> Shadow man. Come on, man. Come on, man. Man, that shit is a run down. Oh, he's in the pit. Okay, so it's, ho it's his house technically, I guess. His parents and... Damn, alright. Damn, how long was he falling? <laughs> what the hell? He went to the catacombs in Paris? What the fuck? What the fuck? Holy shit! No, really, are they in the catacombs right now? Oh my god, skulls everywhere! Devil binding ritual. Ooh, shit. Oh, so that's how he has four. Hmm. They <laughs> so just step right in a circle. You never step in a damn circle when it comes to like <laughs> rituals and shit. Oh, it's double. Okay. Damn, boy, arm gone. Oh man, finally get to see what he look like. Fight the devil in the way. Ain't this some gnarly some schnapp? <laughs> I guess I should say animation because it happens quite often. I only took his arm too. He kind of it kind of resembles Asta a little bit, like maybe hair wise, like if Asta. Actually, I say a little bit. Cost <laughs> a real one.
Yeah, he's he's used that damn black Asta for him. Ooh, I can't even count, guys. I ain't lying to y'all. Can you count? I mean, probably somebody out there, but shit. It's been a many a times he used this shit. Whooping people ass, going through volcanoes. Uh, shit, I'm, I'm, I know I'm forgetting one. <laughs> like it's something stupid, but he's turned into it quite a bit. Man. <laughs> Looks so funny without with just one arm. <laughs> Unbelievably stupid. smaller in the real world but oh my god damn boy taking the grimoire too <laughs> yeah that's really unfair now what Austin about to do just punch his ass what, what, one arm punch here Nintendo fight him. <laughs> He's just like, fight! Fight! Whoa! <laughs> Grotesque. Wow! Right now. Oh shit! Hmm. Like how he said that. Well, damn, he gonna mess up his decor, man. Hmm. What? Out of here. Hmm. Was that the that was a person from the opening, right? It's gotta be this man's mama. It's gotta be his mama. Come on, son. Alright. Oh, they actually added a petite clover in here. Wow. <laughs> we <laughs> we got one more episode left and they added this joint, huh? His heroics or what? His long shit! <laughs> wow, after they said all that, I kind of feel, I kind of feel niche now. I hate them. <laughs> I wonder, can you get a transfer? I'm the hmm. Oh, did she take care of him? Huh. The far. Oh, 
Alright, man. Um, Looks like we're going to end on like kind of like a good way to end off, I feel like. But I'll, I'll get to it later but in the preview portion. But this episode, basically, I guess you kind of want to... I kind of want to say the setup episode for next episode, really. But now that I looked at the preview, it's not really a setup episode. You, you'll see what I mean. But it seems like everybody basically is getting ready to attack the Spade Kingdom. You know, uh, Noelle and her group that were in the Heart Kingdom, they woke up and... Um, I forgot what the place is called, but it's like a, sm a small part in the heart in the heart kingdom where I guess the elves have resided this whole time. Like after the elf arc, that's where they went. Uh, apparently, apparently, uh, <laughs> wait a minute. Oh shit. Apparently, uh, Le uh, Licks kids have been alive this whole time now we didn't get to see the mom but apparently from what Nero said she felt a pulse like when she thought she was dead when we got that little flashback a long time ago she thought she was dead but then she felt the pulse and then also she said one of the twins was alive so she ended up I guess like sealing the wounds with her lock magic or whatever and that's when she left to go help um uh, what's his name? The the the, um, the wizard, the wizard king back then. Uh, la, 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 la. It starts with an L. Fuck. <laughs> I'm sorry. Anyways, but yeah, apparently she survived and the kids survived because there's two kids. That's why I'm like, oh, what? Because she said one of the twins survived. So I don't know. Maybe she like kind of miss um, since that and both of them survived. But yeah, apparently they're both there with all the rest of the elves don't know where the mom is though they, they haven't said so but yeah and apparently when all the people exploded all of them survived on their own behalf they used their magic and blocked the explosion so that's good to know but afterwards they were down for the count like, everybody was, like knocked out and shit but uh petrie and them they came saved everybody took them back to I guess regenerate on them and he said basically what did he say Dar the dwarf i was about to say dwarf darof or darof or something basically told them to come save them basically so some kind of I actually don't even know. An entity or something told them to save them. Regardless, now they're about to be trained by the elves. So that's actually pretty interesting. And I, honestly, I'm curious how strong they are now. And will they help them in this fight to come? Because I feel like, at least Petri, I, I, the other ones too, I guess. I feel like they're strong enough to like tangle with the devil. So I don't know. But they're about to train with them, basically. And they all got like three days to train. Afterwards, um, we got a little bit with the, um, with the, um, oh my god, with the damn, uh, <laughs> commanders and all of them. We got a little bit with them, uh, you know, talking about they're yeah, about to get ready in three days and whatnot. Julius was like, alright, we gotta, we gotta train, get ready in three days or whatever, we're gonna attack. So, the rest of the episode really, well, first we get, we get Nick knocked, whatever. We get this fool, he goes to the Black Bulls base, and he just starts talking shit about everybody. He's like, I, he was like, they are like, why haven't you, like, you're, you're the vice captain. Why haven't you been here this whole time? And he's like, I just, I hate the Black Bulls, you know. I hate that somebody can be bad at first, but if once they do one good thing, then like people love them for it. And that is so true. And that that's like that's like I honestly I, I don't know about in real life. In real life that's questionable and that all depends on like what you did bad, right? But in anime, that is a hundred percent true. Somebody can be a horrible person in anime, but if they do one good thing. <laughs> People love him. That that is true. But um and I love what he said afterwards too where he was like uh the the people I love is like people that are good from the get go. I like that line right there. But he was just going neck person to person. He went to Vanessa, he's like, you know, the witch that drinks non-stop. Uh Fenroy he's awesome. The the ladies man that he loves women so much it gets in the way on his mission. Uh Goche. The 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 crook who begin the crook that's now like good now or whatever. And I forgot what he said about Grey, but regardless he was talking shit about everybody. He talked shit about even Zora and Magna. Magna, understandably. <laughs> oh, 
But yeah, this man was just like, um, I'm about to take Austin. We're about to train or whatever. You got, if you want to come long, we got three days. Y'all need to train and get stronger. Deuces. And he just dipped. So him and Austin, they went to his house apparently. And I say it's his house because in the house there was a portrait with him in it. Um, so they go there, they go seem like to the basement, it looked like some damn, like I said, the catacombs or something with skulls everywhere, shit. We do find out from what he said that like the skulls are from people that he had to kill because they failed this ritual. So he's got skull. he got a whole bunch of skulls. And basically the ritual is you sum, well apparently he says usually you have to have a relic or whatever to summon the demon but for Asta he has like his arm, the grimoire and apparently he said himself is like a connection to the devil and it seems like that's the case at least from the preview the next episode but you know he sum, like the, his arm, Asta's arm disappears and the devil gets summoned and I find it the devil kind of looks like Asta a tad bit like I don't I like to me kind of looks like him a little bit and you know he's like talking talking shit to Asta but Asta thanks him for like allowing him to use his powers throughout these you know uh journey or whatnot and you know the devil's like you're a fool I'm about to kill your ass and take your body and then he just summons the sword out the grimoire starts attacking Asta but then Asta's like Asta's like I'm not gonna fight you and then, uh, and then she's like, yeah, you're going to fight him because you're going to die if you're not. And then Austin's like, nah, he's not even trying to kill me. Like, I can tell from the key. And I'm like, what? So apparently the devil's not really trying to uh, kill him. Just like swinging around, I guess. And um, Austin says something. And like when the devil's looking at him, it reminds him of this woman. And obviously, I feel like this is Austin's mom. Like, she looks spot on like this man. And But like that's how the episode ends. And now, going into the preview, I want to say, I feel like this is like a perfect way to end the end. Like, it, it like, okay, based on what I'm saying, it's like we're ending at 170 regardless, right? We don't know if we're getting a, a sequel, like, you know, season two or a movie or something like that. But if we're going to end right here... This is perfect, right? We're getting the backstory right here, you know, during this fight that seems pivotal to Oscar, right? And this is the fight in the devil. Um, apparently, though, in this preview, it looks like I'm, I'm, I, the woman looks like she's like she saved the devil or like she's taking care of the devil, one of the two. And also, it looks like um, she has a, like we can we see the baby, like we see a baby. So obviously, I feel like that's Oscar, right? Um, now that also, that begs the question, like, um, who the hell is his dad? But I, I don't know, maybe at a later date we'll find that out, but this 100% I can feel like this is his mom. Like, this is like, he just, she just looks too much like Austin. And I'm really curious though, like, where this devil came from is what I'm trying to say. Like, where this devil came from, like... I'm guessing, like, like from what she said in the preview, she was just like, you're not a bad devil. Like, that's what Austin said, too, at the end of the episode. So, I'm guessing this devil is different from the other devils. Or maybe because she shows him kindness, he turns different. One of the two. But I'm pretty sure we're going to find out next episode. And I'm very much eager to see this damn episode. Because, you know, just like with, uh, you know, we found out his past. I was like, man, when are we going to find out Austin's past? Here we are. So, I am interested in what's about to happen next episode. It sucks, man, that next episode is the last episode. Y'all know, man, I've been rocking with this shit since episode one, man. Like, I don't know. Tuesday's going to hit a little different now after next Tuesday. Oh, man. But it is what it is. I, I really hope, though, that we get, like, you know, a season two. But, like, you know, I guess maybe, like, next year, right? I, I really hope so. Either that or a movie. I don't know necessarily how the movie could. Because I feel like in the manga, I, I don't read the manga, but I'm guessing they're still on this arc, right? So a movie wouldn't help. So I really hope that we get like a season two at a later date. Where we don't, we they don't have to like throw you know filler at us, especially right not right now. I'm like, what kind of filler would you throw at us right now? It's like three days to attack. Like we're in the midst of war right now. So. Yeah, man, I, I just really hope we get Black Clover back sooner than later, but 
We'll see. We'll see. Whenever that announcement is, I'm, I'm sure, you know, one of y'all will tell me I'll find out somehow on YouTube or something. Or, like, uh, maybe, like, at the end of the episode, they'll tell us. But I I'm just ready for whatever the news is. But that's all, guys. Remember, for more Black Clover or other anime live reaction slash reviews, make sure the subscribe button down below if you're new to the channel or you're coming off and then you ain't subscribed yet. Y'all know I've been rocking with Black Clover since day one. So go ahead and hit that subscribe button for the button for more. <laughs> hit the bell to get on when I drop my videos. Follow me on Instagram, Twitter, my Facebook game page, and the Discord. All of them in the description box below. If you like the video, guys, like the video, comment, then that's your favorite part of the episode was. And as always, guys, it's been your boy X, and I'm out. Deuces.